Well, it's a first for the United States, and that is a vaccine for insects. The USDA has given conditional approval for a vaccine that is designed to protect honeybees from a deadly disease. Fox 43's Alyssa Kratz spoke to experts at the farm show about the potential breakthrough and why it could be an important part of our global food source. Crowds buzzing around the Pennsylvania State Beekeepers Association stand at the farm show. It's a popular stop, a way to learn more about one of our world's most important pollinators. If we didn't have bees, we would not get all the food we have now. From apples to corn, honeybees pollinate 75% of the fruits and veggies we eat. But experts say for over 100 years, a deadly bacterial disease has been contributing to a global population decline. It's a spore that can like last 80 years. It'll last in the ground for, for almost forever. So occasionally, bees, when they're stressed, they'll pick up American fowl brood, and it's actually contagious. Now, a potential breakthrough. The USDA approving its first ever insect vaccine to help protect the bugs. It, it sounds like it's got some hope from some reliable sources that we know of and we'll, have, we'll wait and see. Don't expect to see any syringes though. This vaccine is given as food, first to worker bees who then feed it to the queen. The vaccine, which contains dead bacteria, is transferred into her ovaries and then to developing eggs, giving larvae immunity as they hatch. The main thing is monitoring the hive. Make sure that they are active and happy with the queen. It's making babies. Members of our state's beekeepers association say there's still a lot to learn. We're hesitant to make a conclusion because we see a lot of silver bullets over the years for different issues. So it's kind of a wait and see. But they're hopeful it could be a game changer. Alyssa Kratz, Fox 43 News. And the vaccine is expected to be distributed on a limited basis to commercial beekeepers and be available to purchase in the U.S. this year.